All right, everyone. So Devontae Adams has addressed some of these trade rumors um, while he was on Club Shay Shay, which is Shannon Sharp's podcast. So we're reading a transcript from the New York Post. Well, I'll answer it like this. If I'm going to be reunited with anybody, it would be Aaron or relocated and be anywhere. It'd be Aaron. But that's not really my there was a lot of stuff going on last year in the media and them asking, what are you going to do about this? Are you thinking about going here? And they talk about whatever without me even being involved in it. And it ended up getting all the way to the point where it got into the locker room and people was thinking that I was the driving force. And I'm like, y'all just don't understand, man, when you and I hate to say it like this because it makes me sound like I'm trying to put myself on a pedestal. But when you're a certain level player, it don't come. It don't have to come from you. And oftentimes it's not coming from you. Actively on the Raiders. What do I look like sitting here talking to other people about being on another team? And that's how I still feel about it right now. I'm locked in with the Raiders and are. And I, and I really feel good about this team. And as far as I know, they feel good about me. If that ever changes, if that got to a point where they weren't feeling the same way, I ain't done playing. So obviously we would figure out whatever we needed to figure out. So I think Adams actually does an amazing, amazing job here of kind of walking a tightrope, right? He's in a, he's, this is a terrible situation to be in. On one hand, you played with a Hall of Fame quarterback or soon to be Hall of Fame quarterback when he retires for all these years. And obviously, you still like him. Obviously, as he said, he would love to still play with him. So you don't want to bash your former you know, quarterback. And also, you want to make it clear, okay, hey, I like where we're at with the Raiders. And he's been very complimentary of the Raiders and you know their new coaching staff, Antonio Pierce, right, and everything that's going on there. So... You can't really say, oh, it's crap or whatever. I would never do it. And I think he does a good job, right? What he's saying is, listen, right now I'm all in on these Raiders, right? I want to be a part of this team. I like this team. I think we could do some things. On the other hand, I love Aaron. And if there was another place I would want to be, it would be with him. And so keep your eyes on the Raiders, right? Because if they start slow, if it's not looking like they need it to look, well, guess what? Devontae Adams may be one of the first ones to be on the trading block because he may start getting upset and the Raiders may figure, listen, we have like one of the best receivers in the league on our team. We can get a lot for him on the trade market. So we're just going to do it because we're not winning enough games this year anyway. So we might as well just get some assets to keep building this thing. So keep your eye on this, but I thought Devontae Adams did a great job. You know, he, like I said, he walked the tightrope of, He's not going to sit there and say, oh, no, I would hate to play with Aaron Rodgers. I'm not going to do that. But also, he's not going to say, I want out of the Raiders because he doesn't. He likes it there, and he thinks they're going to be good this year. And we will see at what Antonio Pierce can do with that team. I mean, you know you have guys like Max Crosby. It's probably going to come down to that quarterback play. So thank you all for watching, and we'll see you next time.